In Wales today, a fraud investigation. Thanks Clive, welcome to Wales Today, I'm Lucy Owen. The headlines. Good evening, a fraud investigation has been launched at Wales' largest health board. Specialist investigators were called in to Betsy Cadwallader University Health Board when auditors discovered £122 million was not properly accounted for. Well, our reporter Chris Dearden can tell us more. Um, Chris, it's a lot of money. What's happened to it? So, Chris, what will investigators be doing now to try and find out what's happened? A second day of ambulance strikes in Wales, set for the 28th of December, has been called off. There are plans to dispose of low levels of radioactive waste at the site of the former nuclear power plant in Gwynedd. The owner of the Trausvanid site, Magnox, has confirmed it's looking to bury some of the waste and cap it with concrete. One anti-nuclear group says it'll cause serious safety issues. Gareth Pennant has more. A unique partnership between one of Wales' leading universities and a community drop-in centre in Swansea is aiming to give more people access to higher education, regardless of their background. University of Wales Trinity St David's has joined up with the centre in Blenheim and organisers say hundreds of people have been going to their events. Gary Owen reports. New stem cell research could mean babies with congenital heart defects won't need repeated heart surgery in the future. A 13-year-old boy from Cardiff who's already had two open heart surgery operations and is expecting a third hopes the research carried out by his surgeon will lead to a permanent cure for other children. Stephen Fairclough reports. Now, a campaign aiming to provide festive cheer to those in need across Swansea and Neath Port Talbot, so they've had more requests for help this year than ever before. Well, time for the Christmas weather forecast now, Sabrina. And that's Wales Today. I'll be back with an update a little later this evening. That's at five past 11. But until then, from all of us here, thank you so much for your company and enjoy your evening. Bye-bye.